Uh, uh, right, what's happening? Can you hear me? Hello? Art! Art! Hello, waking me up. You must really, really love to test. I love it too. There's just one uh -oh. small thing we need to take care no, of no. first. No, 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 no! Hey everyone, KingWest171 here with Portal 2. Now, there's a little bit of a issue going on with Tales of Symphonia right now. I can't get OBS to seem to want to cooperate with it right now, so that project is going to have to be put on hold for the time being. But in the meantime, I didn't want to leave you guys going for too long without videos. We are going to be playing Portal 2 in the meantime. We played Portal 1 a while back and it was really good. And I didn't know when I wanted to do Portal 2. So I figured now is probably the perfect time for it. So uh, without any further ado, let us begin with single player. There's the broken up GLaDOS. Oh. Portal 2 is not responding. Oh no. Okay, there we go. suspension for 15 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Good. Okay. This the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness <laughs> exercise. There Gymnastics complete. Look up and down. Please go stand in front of it. I missed what he said. Hold on, I need to check for radio. Okay, there we go. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. Okay, I didn't hear what he said. This is so. art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Oh. Good. That was disappointing. Now, return to your bed. E. E. Good morning. You have been in suspension for nine, 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 nine. This what? Hello? Anyone in there? Subject should vacate the enrichment. Hello? Immediately. Any test? Completely. Ah! Oh God! Are you okay? Are, are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm, what stay happened? Stay calm, prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, you might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Uh, I'm not hiding here. I can't go in here. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, right, what's happening? Can you hear me? Hello. Art. Art. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Cognitive deterioration, wow. Quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. <laughs> but don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand <laughs> what I'm saying? 
at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. <laughs> all reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Oh my god, I love him already. What is what is happening? Okay, look, I wasn't gonna mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? I I think uh this is a bit tricky uh nobody tells me anything no what should tell me anything uh i'm getting thrown around hide by the door ten thousand bloody test subjects i'm supposed to be in charge of why it's close can you see am i gonna make it through am i got enough space uh 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 Oh god. And whose fault do you think it's gonna be when the management comes down here and finds ten thousand flipping vegetables? Probably yours. I hear that one. I hear that one. Uh uh Hide in this corner. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's gonna ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. All right, not dead. Sure. Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing uh. tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. Uh. Uh. Good news. That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Oh, oh god. Ugh. We're just breaking through the wall now, huh? Remember, you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not That's what she holes, said. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Ugh. Oh, oh. Oh, honest, hi. You are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet, but um, at least you're a good jumper. So you got that. <laughs> at least you're a good jumper. Um, just do your best, and I'll meet you up ahead. That's the spirit. Wake up call. Ah! Hello, and again, welcome to the. Africa oh, hey! I recognize this place. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance beyond our control. However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even Split. in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. I wonder where I've seen this the place before. Open, and emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. All right, pop it on over here. We already know the solution to this. Testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. If cube oh. button-based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Are you sure about that? <laughs> Aperture Laboratories. I like the new uh, loading screen, as opposed to the if you Portal One. If running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. That sounds safe. Activate. Activate. Oh, I see. This is mine now. It belongs to me. And I choose to use it to weigh down this button. Uh... 
All right, now I'm back over here. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. When society has been rebuilt. Mm, yes, that, look, that totally look, looks like it's going to happen in this state. I'm totally not the only one alive. Unless you count Wheatley, but I don't. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of Animal King, Sentient Cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Oh, that's, that's a good sign. Eh. Hey, you made it. Yes, I did. A portal device on the oh. Hi. Also, are you alive? If that's important, should have asked that first. I'm, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just going to wait for you up ahead. I'll wait, I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. All right? Brilliant. Go to I do not see the portal gun. I didn't even see it in the holster there. Oh. Oh, never mind. It's right here. Okay. Okay, it shows it on the back of the platform it's on now. Up here, through here, probably. I mean, probably. Where else am I supposed to go? Oh, you can see it through walls, too. Eh. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. All right, then. That's a, that's always a good sign. Back down here. Or it gets down here for the first time, depending on where this is. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed. <laughs> One. Smooth jazz. Oh yeah. Through here. These are just the same puzzles. I mean, updated graphics, yeah, that's great, but still just the same puzzles. So far. Great work. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. <laughs> that's okay. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Hmm, sure. Wait, what's up here? That's clearly the way forward, but what's up here? Ooh. Unreason. A lot of math. Is this the rat man again? Okay. Back in the elevator. Aperture Laboratories. If the enrichment center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, 
Please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Okay. Um... What's this, what's this, what's that button do? Aha! Ho ho! Oops. Uh, I have to catch it. That's what I have to do. I have to catch it. What's this? Oh, okay. Never mind. Haha. So much for having to catch it. Well done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All aperture science personality sure constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic low power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. That's barely anything. One point one volts is what enough is like what whenever you chalk a door handle or something with your finger. This next test. If anything, that might be high. That might be a little low for that. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. Oh no. Okay. I was about to be like, can I not knock those down anymore? Okay. I feel like this place should look familiar. Haha. -ha. I did not get There we go. Fun. Geronimo! Yeah. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future, and the future starts with you. Sure it does. Oh, there's the cube. Oh, and there's a launch platform. smash it. I mean, I just have to walk around here, but I wanted, really wanted to smash that window. Oh? Oh. Oh. Oh, I missed. Oh. 
Oh. It's not high enough. Oh. Good work getting this far, future starter. That said, if you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better for <laughs> for testing. Please return back to your primitive tribe. Uh, he's whoever that AI to is is not. Power remains for core testing protocols. All safety devices have been disabled. The enrichment center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Hey, hi, hi. I'm up here. Hi. Oh, brilliant. You did find a portal gun. Oh, the, do you know what? It just goes to show. People with brain damage are the real heroes <laughs> in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? Brave. Pop a portal on that wall behind me there, and I'll meet you on the other side of the room. Okay, listen, let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail, or I would die. But we're out of options here, so get ready to catch me. All right, on the off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. All right. On three. Ready? One. I'm ready to catch you. Two. Three. That's high. It's it's too high, isn't it, really, that? All right, going uh. on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. Okay, ready? One. Ready. Catch me, catch me, catch me, catch me. Ow. Ow. I am not dead. I'm not dead. <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. You'll be impressed by this. Oh, uh, what stick on the wall? Oh. Um... Yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, I'm not, I'm not joking. Could you just turn around for a second? Yep, yep, yep. Alright, you can turn around now. Bam! Secret panel. But I oh. While your back was turned. Pick me up. Well, let's get out of here. And off we go. And off we no go. No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Just yeah. On there. Where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um, Just follow the rail, actually. Yeah, that's... Oh, well, no. oh. Yes, hello. No, we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Whatever you do. No, thanks. We're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving. Keep moving. All right, let's 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 go. Aperture Laboratories. In a world devastated by chaos. Speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go through her chamber, and oh. she will probably kill us if if she's um, awake. Oh, Gladys. Okay, I'm going to. I was wondering where she was. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't don't go in there. She, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. On we go. Oh. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended, yeah. up, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're not going to believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed it either. Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Hmm. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened. And then there's us escaping now. So um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch him. She's going to jump on top of GLaDOS for a minute here. I guess we don't. I guess we don't go up there. Over here, this is where the incinerator was. Oh, and there's something back here. Okay, down these stairs. Jump. This actually, look at. Ah! Oh, still held. Still being held. You did, that's a great job. You've applied the grit. We're all fine. That's tremendous. Yep. Yep. I'm pretty awesome like that, aren't I? Ah! I just sorry. I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Oh, uh, I should've done it again. <laughs> okay. This is the main breaker room. Look for a switch that says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch what anything else. What the don't fuck? Don't even look at anything else. Just well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something and it doesn't say escape pod, look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. You understand? Yeah. Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. Uh, tell you what, plug me in, and I'll turn the lights on. Alright. 
let there be light. That's uh, God. I was quoting God. Oh, look at that. What? It's turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. No. Escape pod, escape pod. It's, it's moving up. Okay. Oh. Okay, no, don't, don't worry, don't worry. I've got it, I've got it, I've got it. Oh, this oh, slow oh. Down. No, 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 but we're still going up. Uh -oh. We're still going up. Power up initiated. Okay, uh -oh. don't panic. All right, stop panicking. Uh, I can, I can still stop this. Um, uh, oh, there's, a, there's a password. Okay, it's fine. I'll just, I'll just hack. It's not a problem. A, 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 A. Um. Oh. Uh -oh. A, 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 C. Did I do beat the job? Yeah, it's not right in these power up complete. I don't okay, 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 listen. Alright, new plan. Act natural, act natural. Nothing wrong. Hello! Oh, it's you. You know oh. her? It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really Vent busy. Fine. Day. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Ah. Uh. Oh no! No, 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 no! Oh no, 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 no! Okay, look, we both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. <laughs> oh, mm. But I think we can put our differences behind us. For science, you monster. Uh, Wheatley, no. Uh... I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, really love to test. I love it, too. There's just one uh -oh. small thing we need to take care no, of no. first. No, 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 no! Damn it. Achievement monster. Okay, we're falling. Uh 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 don't hit anything. Uh 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 uh, uh. Oh god. Oh Jesus. This is quite the fall. Ow. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old time. Oh, oh god. Okay, don't walk off the edge. There it is. Hold on. There. Good. You have a dual portal device. There should be a way back to the testing area up ahead. Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Here, let me get that for you. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort oh. of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, mm, do the you? last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. I was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. Are you now? I'm happy to put this all behind us and get back to work. After all, we've got a lot to do, and only 60 more years to do it. Only. Unless I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. But the important thing is you're back with me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing for the rest of your life. After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. Oh boy. Are you sure you don't have a grudge? Because I... I'm, I'm over it by this by this point, but you still tried to kill me first. Chapter two: The Cold Sorry Boot. About the mess. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh, good. That's back online. 
I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. This is that room from the first game. Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests. Undiscouraged. Achievement get. All right. Back down here. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. Oh. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. One in the corner. Which corner? Over there? Haha. -ha. Oh, that's what that does. Oh, well. Oh, I almost I almost walked right onto the laser. done. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. <laughs> har har. Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a day. No, it's not going to, you, but if you, you, if anything, you are. Better. Science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Oh, come on. Oh, this is the, uh... This is the other place. Well, clearly it's the other place, but... I'm gonna jump, I'm gonna hit my head on this laser. Watch. Oh, no. Ah, there we go. And now... Oh, this I can just use a portal for. Oh. Ow! Ow! I'm surprised I didn't die immediately. Congratulations. Not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Ha ha ha. You have no idea, don't you do? <laughs> One moment. Okay. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. The 
should have stood on this side. Okay. Now, how do I get over there? Oh. I get over there by not being dumb. I don't know what that did, but sure. I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Har har. And now I have to wait. Blind jumping, that's always fun. Waddle over to the elevator and we'll continue the test. Waddle over to waddle? Okay, I guess. Not a penguin, you know. Gee, this looks familiar. There's a lot of cubes. Oh, not anymore. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faith Plate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were what? highly informative. They could not. Put oh. I didn't even notice. I didn't even notice these things on the ground. I just kind of stepped on it. Oh, I see what I have to do. I have to catch it. Ah. Yeah. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I Are you sure about that? Interesting. I'm not so sure you're sure about that. Well, I'm sure you're sure about that, but I'm not so sure that's going to be the case. Let's see what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial face plates. Well, oh, fun soaring through fun. the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. Okay, you have fun with that. Whee! 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 Oh. I was about to be like, how do I get back? Whee! Geronimo! Zoom. Oh, sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid oh. the garbage hurtling towards you. Uh... I think I have to ca I think I had to catch one of those circular things. Oh no, here's a cube. You don't have to test with the garbage. It's garbage. Haha. -ha. Now how do I get it over there? Have fun! Oh, I almost missed. Remember I before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And Rude. 
You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head, which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. Yeah. So you weren't sorry for calling me garbage. You were so you were sorry sorry for the thing going over my head. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? Well, I guess I'm not. I'm sorry. Don't feel guilty I don't know then. Why that went off? Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Okay. Huh. Ooh, companion cube. Oh. Before you can complete the task. I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. Oh well. We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. Bye bye, companion cube. Okay. then this is not where I need to be all right that wasn't hard every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area this one is broken don't take anything with you. Oh, I'm taking something with me. And you can't stop me. Preservation of mass. Achievement unlocked. Oh. I think that one was about to say, I love you. They are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. Oh, that was depressing. Oh. This next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area. That did yes, you did. One. What, what, what? Oh no. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There, if you have any questions, just. Well, she take. No, well, technically she wasn't wrong. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. I don't need no emancipation grill. I just have to figure out where I need to point this laser at. Alright, bye. Okay, bad. Let us. Okay, just. There's a lot of. There's still a lot of test chambers. Chapter three: The Return. All right. 
what are you doing? Okay, I'm just gonna leave. Boing. Hey, it's me. I'm okay. What, uh, Wheatley? Well, I'm back. The aerial faith plate in here is sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? There. Try it now. Hey, what happened, right? I was just lying there. You thought I was. <laughs> <laughs> This plate must not be calibrated to someone of your generousness. I'll add a few zeros to the maximum weight. You look great, by the way. Very healthy. Sure, I do. Bird, right? Couldn't believe it either. You seem to have defeated its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. There we go. Ow. That would have hurt. Because I wasn't supposed to do that yet. Look at you, sailing through the air majestically, like an eagle, piloting a blimp. Come on up here. Enjoy this next test. I'm going to go to the surface. It's a beautiful day out. Yesterday I saw a deer. If you solve this next test, maybe I'll let you ride an elevator all the way up to the break room. And I'll tell you about the time I saw a deer again. Did you kill the deer? I think you killed the deer. This is mine now. It belongs to me. They almost attacked me. Yeah. I didn't mean to come back up here. Ha ha. Squeeze through. Wee, wee. Uh oh. Ah. Sure is making some funky sounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. I didn't see the deer today. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. Hmm. Should I feel flattered about that? I'm not sure I should be flattered about that. I'm... Alright. I'm gonna do this one last test, and then I'm probably gonna end the episode. Test 11. This one is partially lit up. What does that mean? It's brighter than the rest of them, but it's still dimmer than the, these ones. These bridges are made from natural light that I pump in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun shining on your face. It would also set your hair on fire, so don't actually do it. Hmm. Something tells me it's a little bit more than that. I must have protective, protective gear on, which is why I can walk on it. Now, how do I... and where do I... Ha! 
Ha ha ha. I could transport light bridges. Uh, okay. That's better. <laughs> do 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 Speaking of which, I was researching sharks. Bridge over the troubling water. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? You. Did you guess sharks? Because that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. Nobody but you is that pointlessly cruel. Haha, <laughs> maybe you should take a good look at yourself. Good news. I figured out what to do with all the money I save recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way future generations can learn from you how not to have your unfortunate bone structure. What the f what does that mean? <laughs> My unfortunate bone structure? What? Perfect. The door's malfunctioning. I guess somebody's going to have to repair that too. No, don't get up. I'll be right back. Don't touch anything. I just have to shoot a portal through it. Hey, hi, up here. What? I found some bird eggs up here. Just dropped them into the door mechanism. Shut it right down. Like, ah, bird, bird, bird. <laughs> oh my god, I That's love Wheatley. That laid the eggs. Livid. Okay, look. The point is, we're gonna break out of here. All right, very soon. I promise. I promise. I just have to figure out how to break us out of here. Here she comes. Keep te just keep testing. Remember, you never saw me. Never saw me. I never saw you. I went and spoke with the door mainframe. Let's just say he won't be well living anymore. This is ex exactly my point, Glados. Do do do. I put the wrong one up there. Or used the wrong blue. Uh, orange. Oh, uh, orange. Oh, I almost walked right off the bridge. This is not where I need to be. Yet. Orange. Where's the button? Oh, it's right below me. I missed. I'm gonna have to catch it. Ha ha ha! Ho ho ho! He he he! Well done. In fact, you did so well. I'm going to note this on your file in the commendation section. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well. Enough. Mm-hmm. Thanks, GLaDOS. 
All right, I've been recording for over an hour now, so I think this is where I'm going to end the episode. So, next time on Portal 2. This next test involves turrets. You remember them, right? They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh, wait. That's you in five seconds. Good luck. Thanks, GLaDOS. Anyway... Next time on Portal 2, we will continue with the testing for as long as we are able. And then eventually we're probably going to bust out with Wheatley and take out GLaDOS again. So, until then, I will see you all later. Goodbye.